finally tonight, a farmer who just would not give up, digging in his field in Michigan when he thought he hit a fence post. Finally, a farmer who just would not give up digging in his field in Michigan has finally gotten what he deserved. What began as a routine day of digging on a farm in Michigan suddenly became a moment for the history books when a farmer unearthed something truly shocking beneath his field. From ancient relics to unexpected treasures, the earth beneath our feet holds untold stories waiting to be discovered. In this exploration of underground finds, we delve into the thrilling world of discoveries made while digging, where every scoop of soil has the potential to reveal our past in surprising ways. Here are 20 astonishing discoveries made by farmers that'll leave you in awe. 20. Mammoth Bone A farmer in Michigan, James Bristle, was digging in one of his fields when he unearthed something shocking. Initially, he and his friend thought they had found a bent fence post, but it turned out to be part of an ancient woolly mammoth's pelvis. As paleontologists from the University of Michigan excavated the site, they uncovered a skull with two enormous tusks, ribs, vertebrae, and both shoulder blades of the mammoth. This remarkable creature is believed to have died thousands of years ago, and the discovery suggests that early humans might have butchered and stored the meat. James's find is the most complete mammoth remains discovered in Michigan, demonstrating that you never know what treasures can be hidden on your property. I kind of like expect y'all to do some digging at your backyard. Who knows? Maybe what you might discover will be the next talk of the season. 19. Enigmalith How does it feel like when you make a new discovery completely different from what you were thought in school? In 1998, electrical engineer John J. Williams stumbled upon a mysterious object during a hiking trip in North America. The object appeared to be an electrical connector protruding from the ground, embedded in solid granite. This artifact, known as the Petex, has fueled speculation and skepticism with John keeping the exact location of the discovery secret. Geological analysis suggests the rock surrounding the component is at least 100,000 years old, deeply challenging our understanding of technological development. X-ray tests reveal an opaque internal structure, and the component itself shows weak magnetic properties and high impedance between the pins, akin to an electronic XLR connector. John believes the Petex is a genuine artifact from an advanced ancient civilization, or possibly of extraterrestrial origin, and he is willing to let researchers authenticate the artifact, provided the rock remains intact during analysis. 18. Diamond Ring I'm very sure Mother Nature have some days she really likes to burrow our stuffs. But what's very surprising is that she will give them back someday, but in a mysterious way. Mary Grahams, a woman from Alberta, Canada, lost a precious diamond ring while working in her garden, only to find it 13 years later on a carrot of all things. Mary had kept the loss a secret, even buying a replacement ring to hide the incident. However, her daughter-in-law, Colleen Daly, found the ring while harvesting vegetables on the family farm, with the carrot having grown straight through the ring, keeping it safe in the soil all those years. Mary was overjoyed to have her ring back and has learned her lesson vowing to be more careful in the future and to keep the ring in a safe place. 17. Black Sarcophagus If new archaeological discoveries are to be made, that wouldn't be in Egypt, I said. But, this place would not simply stop surprising us with new discoveries. This time, archaeologists in Alexandria, Egypt, recently discovered a massive black granite sarcophagus that had remained untouched for 2,000 years. Speculation ranged from it containing the remains of Alexander the Great to harboring a deadly curse. Upon opening the sarcophagus, they found three skeletons submerged in red-brown sewage water, emitting a terrible stench. The bones were all that remained of the mummies, indicating a family burial. Despite concerns about toxic fumes, experts dismissed the notion of a mummy's curse. Incredibly, the sarcophagus, measuring almost 6.5 feet high and approximately 10 feet long, and weighing 27 tons, is the largest of its kind ever found intact, dating from the early Ptolemaic period after Alexander the Great's death in 323 BC. Further studies will aim to determine the identities and circumstances of the individual's deaths. 16. Remains of Ancient Roman House in some places, everyone doesn't need to be an archaeologist in order to make a discovery. 
For instance, in places like Israel and Syria, you might just be taking a stroll, but suddenly bump into a discovery. Officials in Izmir, Turkey, found something shocking while digging. They uncovered a hole leading to an ancient Roman column, which descended into a 2,700-year-old home belonging to a wealthy family from the early Roman period. The digs, however, were unauthorized, and police have detained three suspects involved in the excavation. Izmir's recent finds include a nearly 2,000-year-old amphitheater and a communal latrine believed to have been used by actors. Additionally, a settlement from 2000 BC was discovered, indicating that the area was a significant trading center during the Bronze Age. Archaeologists also uncovered 2,500-year-old mourning masks used by Ionian women to symbolize grief over their fallen warrior husbands. As excavation work continues, Izmir continues to yield treasures from its ancient past, showcasing its rich historical and cultural significance. 15. Dinosaur Tale Do you love dinosaurs? Well, I'm sorry because we don't have it full here, we've only got the tale, but I think it's enough to keep you chilled. In northern Mexico, paleontologists have uncovered a remarkable find underground, a giant dinosaur tail measuring about 16 feet long and containing 50 vertebrae. The well-preserved tail likely belonged to a hadrosaur, a duck-billed dinosaur that roamed the Earth approximately 72 million years ago. Hadrosaurs could grow to about 40 feet in length, meaning this tail constituted nearly half of the dinosaur's body. Discovered buried in sedimentary rock in Coahuila's desert region by local residents, this is the first intact dinosaur tail of this size found in Mexico and one of only a few discovered worldwide. Paleontologists from the Mexican National Institute for Anthropology and History and the National Autonomous University of Mexico began their excavation after a year of surveying, and alongside the tail vertebrae, they discovered other bones, including a hip bone, suggesting more remains might lie deeper within the rock. The team hopes their findings will clarify how hadrosaur tails moved. 14. Gold Coins Nobody gets hopped up at night than the one who just won a $10 million jackpot. This time, a Northern California couple made a stunning discovery while walking their dog on their property. In February 2013, $10 million in rare gold coins buried underground in the shadow of an old tree. The 1,427 coins date from 1847 to 1894 and are in mint condition, with some so rare they could fetch nearly $1 million each. Experts believe the coins were buried as a form of bank during the California Gold Rush era and then forgotten. The couple, who wished to remain anonymous, found the coins in eight cans along a trail they had walked for years. They plan to sell most of the coins through Amazon, keeping a few as keepsakes, and use the money to pay off bills and donate to local charities. 13. Cold War Fallout Shelter The terrifying days of the Cold War are not forgotten. Sometimes, we have to admire things from the past, but forget about the events that brought them. A homeowner in Arizona discovered a hidden Cold War-era fallout shelter right in his own backyard. Reddit user John Sims found the shelter after a tip from the home's previous owner. The shelter, built in 1961 by a company called Whitaker Pools, is made of concrete with a fiberglass dome. When Sims climbed down into it, he found it empty with no furniture or supplies but he's planning to restore it to its original glory. This find is especially interesting because Tucson, Arizona, used to be home to 18 intercontinental ballistic missiles during the Cold War, armed with nuclear warheads and capable of reaching the Soviet Union in just 25 minutes. 12. Huge Dinosaur Skeleton Okay, dinosaur fans, here we go. But what if you stumble upon something truly extraordinary in an under-ordinary place? In one instance, the largest dinosaur remains ever found in Europe have been discovered in an ordinary garden in Portugal, as everyone, including me expected such discovery in one misty forest. Excavation began in 2017 after the property owner noticed fossilized bone fragments and contacted researchers from the University of Lisbon. Spanish and Portuguese paleontologists recently unearthed vertebrae and ribs believed to be from a Brachiosaurus, one of the largest dinosaurs to have ever lived. The size of the bones indicates that this dinosaur was about 40 feet tall and 80 feet long. The skeleton was found in Upper Jurassic sedimentary rocks, suggesting it's approximately 150 million years old. 
This discovery points to the rich fossil record of late Jurassic vertebrates in the Pombal region, providing valuable insights into the former landscape of the Iberian Peninsula during that time period. 11. Creepy Stone Skulls Now, for y'all who are frightened of what might be lurking in the unknown, this is for you. Emily Hoffman was surprised to discover a mysterious sunken stone skulls in her new backyard in Seattle while digging. Initially startled, Emily thought the skulls were real, but upon closer inspection, she found that the skull shapes were actually concrete stones arranged like skulls. Further investigation revealed that these stones were placed as stepping stones by the previous tenant to prevent the backyard from getting muddy during heavy rainfall. Despite their creepy appearance, Emily decided to keep the skull stones and plans to repair some of them, even joking about naming them. 10. Fully Stocked Shelter Wars are not good, but sometimes they leave behind mind-blowing remnants and great stories that can be passed down to future generations. The Zwick family in Nina, Wisconsin, found something very intriguing while digging, a fully stocked fallout shelter in their backyard, built by the home's previous owner during the Cold War. For years, they had no idea what lay beneath their feet until they decided to explore in 2010. The shelter was like stepping back in time, stocked with everything a family would need to survive for two weeks underground, including food, clothing, medical supplies, and tools. The items were so well-preserved that it was like opening a time capsule from the 1960s. What's even more fascinating is that the shelter contained items that seemed oddly out of place, like a phone directory. The discovery of this well-preserved fallout shelter provides a glimpse into the anxieties and preparations of the Cold War era. 9. Buried Safe As kids, we sometimes dreamed of solving the Oak Island treasure mystery. This time, our dream mates happened to solve theirs. Matthew and Maria Emanuel of Staten Island, New York, experienced a remarkable twist of fate when they discovered an intriguing rusted, rotting metal box buried in their backyard while planting new trees. To their astonishment, the box contained a treasure trove worth $22,000, including gold, diamonds, jade, and wads of wet $100 bills. The couple, who had lived in their home for four years without any knowledge of the hidden treasure, were thrilled by the discovery, describing it as a childhood dream come true. However, it was later revealed that the contents of the safe had been stolen from their neighbors seven years earlier in a burglary reported to the New York Police Department. Despite many questioning their decision, the Emanuels felt it was the right thing to do to return the valuable hoard to its rightful owners, stating that the treasure wasn't theirs. Looking at this, the mystery is still waiting to be solved. 8. Ancient Viking Burial Site Archaeologists in Oslo made an exciting discovery during the construction of a new house, a Viking grave rich in artifacts. The grave contained the remains of a shield, a cape buckle, and various other objects, offering a glimpse into the past. The site, situated on a prominent hill with a picturesque view, was once a valley where the stream Holen Becken flowed during ancient times. Among the items unearthed were fragments of a soapstone vessel, a penannular brooch, two knives, horse tack, and a shield boss. The presence of a penannular brooch, which dates back to approximately 850 AD, helped archaeologists determine the grave's Viking Age origins. This discovery adds to the growing body of archaeological evidence in Oslo, hinting at the city's rich Viking history. 7. Couple Finds Whiskey Stash How well can you preserve liquor? Sounds like a very skillful task, right? but not for the merchants of the 19th century. During a renovation of their over 100-year-old home in Ames, New York, Nick Drummond and Patrick Beer stumbled upon a fascinating piece of history. Rumored to have been built by a bootlegger, the discovery of more than 66 bottles of Prohibition-era whiskey hidden within the walls and floorboards confirmed the legend. The couple, living in the house for just over a year, decided to undertake major renovations. Nick, a designer and historic preservationist, made the unexpected find while removing outside skirting in the mudroom, where a mysterious package fell out revealing a stash of whiskey bottles wrapped in tissue paper and straw. Further exploration led to the discovery of more bundles of smuggled whiskey, shedding light on the home's intriguing past. The liquor, labeled Old Smuggler Jellic Whiskey, was part of a legacy left behind by the home's original owner, Count Adolf Huntfer, a mysterious figure known for his involvement in numerous scandals. 
The couple plans to preserve the empty bottles found and sell the full ones, each estimated at around $1,000. 6. 2,000-year-old Roman Villa Sometimes, important Roman officials would simply not want to be seen in the open, but simply want to live underground. I wonder what was so good about these underground structures. During a routine renovation in Wiltshire, Luke Irwin made an intriguing discovery right underground in his backyard. A remarkably well-preserved Roman villa dating back 1,400 years. While laying an electricity cable in his barn, Luke uncovered an intricately designed mosaic underground, leading to a collaboration with archaeologists from Historic England and Salisbury Museum to excavate the site. The excavation revealed a grand Roman building with a three-story structure. The villa, believed to have been home to a family of high status and wealth, showcased luxurious living evidenced by the discovery of hundreds of oyster shells, high-status pottery, coins, brooches, and the remains of hunted wild animals. This find is particularly significant as it provides insights into Roman life in Britain and may have been the residence of a Roman emperor. Luke, a designer and historic preservationist, expressed his amazement at the discovery, pointing out the rarity and historical value of the find. 5. Serendipity Sapphire Sometimes, nature keeps playing with us. There are places people played gold like soccer ball without knowing it worth, and there are some where diamonds weren't different from common alluvial rocks. In a remarkable discovery, workers digging a well in the backyard of a Sri Lankan home uncovered a massive sapphire cluster estimated to be worth up to $100 million. The gem, weighing an astounding 2.5 million carats, is believed to be the largest sapphire cluster ever found. Located in Ratnapura, known as the gem capital of the world, the find was made behind the home of a third-generation gem trader, the owner identified only as Mr. Gamage. Experts, including top geologist Dr. Gamini Zoa, were astonished by the find, suggesting that the specimen was formed approximately 400 million years ago. The sapphire, now known as the Serendipity Sapphire, is considered a special star sapphire specimen and is expected to attract interest from private collectors or museums due to its size and value. 4. 132-Year-Old Tunnel A 132-year-old tunnel has been accidentally discovered at Mumbai's government-run JJ Hospital, located in Baikula and built during the British era. The hospital uncovered the 656-foot tunnel beneath a medical ward building. Dr. Aaron Rothode, the resident medical officer, explained that the tunnel was found while inspecting the nursing college building for water leakage. Engineers and security guards found the tunnel, which was sealed at one end. The structure was originally part of the S. Dinshaw Manekji Petit Hospital for Women and Children, later converted into a nursing college. The foundation stone of the Heritage Building was laid by Lord Ray, then the governor of Bombay, on January 27, 1890, and the building was designed by architectural executive John Adams and inaugurated on March 15, 1892. Dr. Pallavi Sapple informed the Mumbai collector and the Maharashtra Archaeology Department about the discovery. Dr. Aaron, who inspected the tunnel, described it as 4.5 feet high with several brick pillars. The entrance, sealed with a stone wall, was accessed through a sealed ventilation duct measuring 3 feet by 3 feet. Former hospital employees mentioned that another British-era building nearby might have a similar structure underneath, possibly connected by a tunnel, but this has yet to be confirmed. 3. Wartime Motorcycle Peter Dell, a resident of Raid, sir, made a surprising discovery while digging up his neighbor's backyard to address an ant nest issue, a buried motorcycle frame that he believes to be from the wartime era. This find brought to mind a conversation Peter had with a stranger a few years back, who had inquired about a motorcycle possibly buried in or near a well on the property. The stranger, who came from Hampshire, mentioned that the bike had been buried in the area shortly after World War II. Despite not thinking much of the conversation at the time, Peter now believes he has unearthed the motorcycle in question and is eager to find the mystery man who had inquired about the machine years ago. The shocking discovery was made when Peter noticed a large hole in the ground, which turned out to be an ant's nest, while his neighbor was hosting a garden party. 2. Abandoned Well At some point, life may be like walking on thin ice. After living unknowingly with a dangerous 50 feet deep well in his backyard for 25 years, Brian Day finally had it filled. The well, 
drilled in 1928, was discovered when a small depression formed on his lawn in South Edmonton. Concerned about the depth, Brian decided to dig it out, but was surprised to find a large hole underneath the sod. It took about 2.5 cubic feet of concrete and just several minutes to fill the old water well. Brian was impressed by how quickly the hole was filled and was relieved that the job was done, ensuring the safety of his family and pets. Although the well was incorrectly mapped as being elsewhere, the province's legislation deemed Brian responsible for filling the well. He hopes his experience raises awareness about checking for abandoned wells, as they can pose serious risks if left unfilled. 1. Mystery Car A buried car mystery in Silicon Valley has finally been unearthed. Landscapers in Atherton discovered a convertible Mercedes-Benz buried in a backyard, filled with unused bags of concrete. The car had been hidden there for about 30 years. To the surprise of investigators, after a thorough excavation and examination, no human remains were found, despite the cadaver dogs picking up faint traces of possible human remains. The car was buried four to five feet deep, likely in the 1990s, and was reported stolen in 1992. The car's owner is believed to be deceased, but authorities are still waiting on DMV records for confirmation. Speculation points to Johnny Liu, who built and lived in the mansion during the 1990s. Johnny was not an ordinary individual. He had a colorful past, including convictions for murder, attempted murder, and an arrest for insurance fraud. In fact, he once tried to sink a yacht for an insurance payout. Johnny passed away in 2015, a year after his family sold the house. That's all for today. Feel free to click the video on your screen if you enjoyed this video, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.